Hi, in this tutorial I want to show you how to create this nice carousel effect using Figma prototyping tool. Before getting started in this tutorial, let's go to our description down below and download the exercise file. Here is the exercise file after importing it to Figma. You will find images and components for the app ready to use so we can focus on the prototyping side. Alright, so first let's go and create a new page and let's pick a frame and choose iPhone 14 and 15 Pro Max. Next, let's go and pick the ellipse and let's create head shift key and create an ellipse. Let's move it down to the frame inside my frame. Move it to the top. All right. And let's give it a gradient. So I'm going to choose for this, I will use the plugin UI gradients. Here we have ready to use gradients. Let's pick the gradients you want and maybe change this like that. All right, next let's go to assets and let's bring our cup component. Maybe we'll downsize it, hit the K key and scale it down. Make sure it is centered. Now let's duplicate it, command C, command V and select the frame. Let's go back to layers and uncheck clip content. All right, so we can see what happened outside the frame or outside the edges of the frame. Let's duplicate this again. And here we're going to start by creating our carousel effect. Let me change the images. Select the second cap images. Um, copy its fill value and let's pass it. Select the images inside the component. Let's Hit past again for the third image, copy the fill value and past in the fill value of the component. All right, next select the two cup and hit K key and scale it down. And let's put the second cap in the edge half showing inside and half outside of the frame. All right, let's again clip content of the main frame. Maybe we need to add a navigation bar. So like that, let's keep it selected and let's change the black color to white. Let's move it down like that. So we need this room space. All right. Also, we need this card component. So 
So this will be the products of our home screen. Let's duplicate like that. And you can change the images and the title, but for now we'll focus only on the um, carousel. All right. So we have our um, first screen ready. So let's hit Command C and Command V to duplicate. And the first thing we're going to need, let's select the three caps and move them in a way that the second cap will be on the center of the screen. All right, now let's hit the K key and scale down the first one. You can use this frame as a reference so you can align it with it. Let's keep that like that. And the second one, let me scale it up. All right. And let's change the gradient to orange gradient. Let's pick that. All right. Now, Hit Command C and Command V and duplicate the second screen. And let's select the three cap. Let's do the same thing. Like that. Scale down the second cap. Align it like that. And the last one, let's scale it up and center. All right, now let me create some space between each frame so we can see when we connect each other. Let's pick the prototype and select the first cap and connect it with the second screen. Pick on drag smart animate and jump all right let's connect the second cap with the third screen and pick on drag smart animate jump again the second cap will connect it with the first screen and on drag all right, and this third with the second screen on drag, smart animate, gentle. All right, now let's test our flow. So here we go. If we drag, we have the cap dragging and the color of the background changing. And we need to change this color, the third one, so we have a complete effect. Let's pick this and let's drag. As you can see, this is super simple. That was the end of this tutorial. Thank you guys for uh, watching until the end. Uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe and like button and if you want to see the full tutorials of doing all those effects you can see the link in the description below of this video. Thank you so much and I will see you in another video.